Okay, hey guys, so today we are doing a bit of wall design. I've got this over here so we can do a bit of inside flat wall design um, in a second. Um, first off, I'm going to show you a bit with a bit more of a complex wall design, just a little bit. Um, this is good if you've got, this isn't so good if you've got big area, if you've got small areas like a small house or a cottage or something. Um, unless you're using wood and you want it to be a bit cluttered, then I might show that in another video or something like that. Um, basically, a good way to... I'm just going to make this quite simple, I'm not going to go into it really complicated. Um, make it easy to follow. Um, so, what I'm going to say first is you want to put a bit of pattern on it. So, don't forget that this isn't what you've um this isn't what you're limited to you've got a wall then you're gonna have a whole room you're not limited to this small area of space unless you're like an idiot and this is your house so you can experiment with the space that you've got and do so um for this example i'm using quartz and we can do something like this quite easily do for example a little shape up here um, maybe have uh, these as chisel blocks. Oh shit! And quartz going this side and this side. Um, then you can see how already how this is just a more interesting build. Just a bit more interesting to look at and just seems more fun and interesting. A bit more posh bit more like you put detail and time into it. Um, a lot of people seem to go for small things like item frames and stuff. Um, things The thing is if you want something really good and really detailed looking you don't have to go for the small things. Small doesn't mean detailed. Um, small can mean detailed uh, but not all the time. Not so much. Also if you're having a big build like a um, castle or something, you're going to want something like this inside to make it a bit more, you know, detailed, because for a big castle, this is small. So, um, if you want a bit, a bit better, then uh, play around with slabs. Slabs are a good thing to play around with. For example, if I just do a couple of layers like this, it might not look amazing, but from a distance, or if it's high up or something, it does give just that bit more to the map. It, it really does. It gives that bit more to the style. Um, imagine if we built this up to be a huge tower looking like this. It would look pretty decent, wouldn't it? And you know it would. Um, play around with slabs and play around with the space you've got. Really, really take advantage of the space you've got. If you've got sort of empty space around your walls, there's nothing in and no one's got really go around or explore or anything when there's nothing in the corners of your room or something like this. Honestly, build up your walls, make it look a bit more complex, unless you're going for something quite nice and simple. Um, but yeah, so we've done this, now let's go and make this little place a bit cosier and nicer to live in. So, we haven't got much space here, we haven't got a lot, but I'm just going to go with a few things that I said over there, so what we're going to do is we're going to try a design on each one different design on each thing. So uh, let's go with the same thing that we went out there. Same sort of deal. There we go. We've got a nice simple thing. We'll put the um, leave the quartz till later. Uh, so let's go with something like as we've got this we could go off let's break this. Go off that. Um, maybe add some stairs, upside down stairs to go on there. Um, along with that you can have pillar going up, for example. See, a bit more detailed right there. Same sort of thing, but just adding bits here and there, like the stairs. Um, you could even, I mean, I'd recommend go for something like this, but you could, if you really wanted to, go for, you know, some sort of checkered path, 
pattern or something. Just something to make it a bit more interesting, you know? Like even that, it's, it's giving it more depth. If you want something more to it, you can put stairs in there. Maybe, something like that. You know, just, just see how that's just so much more interesting just to look at now. Um, and we haven't got much space with that, so let's just go with something like... Uh, just something simple. Yeah, just, just see how it's so easy to come up with a little design. And, I mean, all you need to do is pluck a few random blocks somewhere that you think will look quite nice in a sort of orderly fashion. And you've got yourself a nice little pattern, like, nice little design, like, you know. And some of them work really well. If not, scrap it and try again. You know. And, like I say, we could add some... Uh, slabs around here to make it look a bit more just that it does look make it look a bit more complex add some around the top maybe obviously if this was a bigger place it would look a lot better it would be a lot easier to do the slabs and stuff but look you've made yourself a nice little you know it's a bit hectic because every wall is a different design but you've still got yourself here nice little place, nice little really detailed little hut, maybe if you added something like this, maybe it looked like some sort of posh ruins because of how it's sort of laid out and stuff like this. Um, I do like playing with quartz because there's loads of different types of it and it all suits together. Um, makes yourself a little doorway in it, same sort of idea, you can do it on the outsides as well, quite easily, same sort of thing, look. Same sort of thing, really easy, really simple. Here you go. I recommend only going one or two blocks out. Um, if you're doing something huge, then you can go two blocks out, um, but unless you're putting slabs on it, I wouldn't recommend going two blocks out. Um, but yeah, or you could even not go two blocks out like that as well, and just, yeah, really easy to get a nice simple design. So that's a bit of wall work there for you guys. Um, I hope that's helped and hope that'll improve your building. Um, might do some work on doorways soon actually, maybe that can be in the next episode. So I'll... See you next week, guys. Bye!